Hey guys. So, today we went and got this one's blood work. Blood work. Yeah. And then on Friday, he's going to get his surgery done mm -hmm. because he has an infection in his foot. So we're going to take care of that. It's it's the surgery we've been talking about <laughs> for months. Yeah. But he's not he, very he, happy. No, he gave us a little present as we left the uh <laughs> big big present. He, stinky. He he pooped. As he always does, he, it seems like it's more like, hey, get me out of here, I'm gonna let it go, and then we don't get him out quick enough, and he lets it go. Yep. But, yeah. So now, we are going to tell you guys our story. So our story all began on December 30th, 2017. Yeah. And I started taking new meds, like, Two weeks prior, I believe, mm -hmm. to help just like with depression and weight and like all that stuff. Your estrogen level was too high. Too. Yeah, which was kind of weird. But yeah. I've been told that before, so mm -hmm. I didn't really think anything of it. So yeah, so I emailed Greg, and she she felt uh, she told me she's like I don't I don't feel good. I not something's not right. I don't want this medication to cause issues with me so yeah. I think I need to go to the ER make sure that everything's right because it did say that there will be some side effects but yeah. the side effects were getting too intense yeah because I was just like constantly vomiting like all day I couldn't get any mood down it was just like mm -hmm. and we thought because one of the side effects to the medic medication was nausea mm -hmm. and vomiting and I couldn't sleep so that was also a side yeah. effect insomnia was a side effect yeah. too. so it, it's like Pretty much all this, all the like signs of pregnancy. Yeah. <laughs> but from a medication. But medication at the same time. So. Yeah. Didn't so, think anything of it. Just like. Oh. So I I was trying to get off work early so I could come and take her home. Yeah. Take her to the ER. Just waited it out. Yeah, she said, "Don't worry about it. We'll just go and get home." So mm -hmm. I got home and we went. Very quick. Yeah. The didn't take too long. Yeah, the hospital went, went very quick. Yeah. So we're sitting in the. Um, the ER room and you know they ran some tests the doctor came in did, did her thing this question yeah. was, ran some tests the usual type thing they would do mm -hmm. to figure out what the heck's wrong with you she made her do a pee, pee, in, pee a cup. in a cup yeah. just cause she was like oh well Maybe this we're... might be possible but Maybe and we're... I was just like mm, I'm so abnormal like yeah, it's we, not we gonna happen we didn't, we didn't believe it would so then we were sitting there waiting, waiting for like, what, 45 minutes? <laughs> it was a long time yeah. just waiting for the pee test. Yeah. and Everything else went fast, just the pee test was like... <sighs> yeah, so I was literally falling asleep in the chair. Yeah. She was like watching me just like... I was just feeling like crap, just... <laughs> yeah, on, on, the, on the bed, <laughs> and I'm just like over here in the chair like... Passed out. But uh... She was gone. <laughs> yeah. Then she came into the in, back in the room and she's like... Congrats, you're pregnant. <laughs> yeah, congrats. <laughs> we did a double take and we're like, what? Where I was waking up, so I'm like, <laughs> am I dreaming? And she's like, no. Nope. And I kept asking her, I was like, are you serious? And she was like, yeah. Like, she was like, straight up, like, extremely blunt about it. She was like, yeah, you are. Like, we should have known. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> So we were like, we we're still out. We we're still trying to grasp I it. I kept staring at him. And I was yeah. like, what? We, just, we were still trying to grasp onto the fact that, <laughs> I mean, and then like the whole time after that, we we're just like, damn it, this is not the way we wanted to find yeah. out. Yeah. But yeah. At the same time, I was kind of glad Greg was there for it. Because mm -hmm. I think I would be more panicky. And, I don't know. Yeah, you would have probably freaked out. Yeah. And then you probably would have. I mean, it was better because. Like, I don't know how I would have played it off, like after going to the ER. Imagine if I like went with your mom or something. Yeah, imagine my mom went because we were we were talking about like having my mom go with her, so she. But I, was, I probably wouldn't have had her in the room, so still it, I would have been able to tell Greg myself. But I mean, either way, my mom would have kept the secret too. So. Yeah, but I probably wouldn't have told her right there. <laughs> I would have been like, okay, I'll wait till home to surprise you, and then. 
Oh yeah, that's, that's like, another. I probably would have told that's you. That's another part of the story. My parents were actually here to visit, and we were mm -hmm. supposed to be hanging out with them that night. But they felt so crappy, mm -hmm. like the few days that they got yeah. here. So I was like, oh, I just I can't. <laughs> yeah, and they understood, but my mom was like, oh, let me take her. Let me take her to the ER. It'll be okay. I'll take care of her. I'm like, no, nah, mom. So it's kind of good that she didn't go. We had, we ended up telling them the next day. Yeah. Um. But Amy ended up showing me uh, or giving me the the present or the surprise that she wanted to 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 um, say to me, uh, "Hey, you're gonna be a dad," and you know it was great. Here it is. We may not have found out that we're gonna have a child in the way we wanted to. And then Amy's plan to surprise tell me didn't really work out, but we still found out. I'm still super excited and Amy still bought this present for me, so without further ado, it says baby. Baby on board. <laughs> Greg. I may have not been able to surprise you with my pregnancy, how I envisioned it, but I can't, I can't say it's changed my excitement at all. You're going to be the best dad ever. I can't wait to start this new, exciting, crazy, terrifying chapter with you. It's only the beginning. I love you and this little bundle of joy so much. Love always, Amy. When did you make this thing? Today. <laughs> oh, that's, that's so surreal. <laughs> Seeing. Did you do this today? Mm -mm. I did that a long time ago. <laughs> it's cute, huh? Hey. Oh, there's this. <laughs> You've seen that? <laughs> surreal the fact that I'm I'm gonna have a baby with my last name of our last name I just never thought I'd be here I love you this is awesome look at it's special baby that hit my heart a little bit <laughs> not, not gonna lie <laughs> I didn't think I would get emotional, but I just did. So, everyone, there's a lot of excitement coming our way. Yeah. And you're going to be on this journey with us. Yeah. And we're, I am so incredibly blessed to have my wonderful wife and our little nugget that is on the way. I'm nervous, I'm scared, I'm terrified, I'm at all, everything, excited, but, I don't know, on the 22nd of this month, January, we're going to get to hear the heartbeat. I can't wait, because I'm excited to start this journey with my wife. I'm getting emotional, so Amy, <laughs> cut. <laughs> So we are here at the uh, doctor's for Amy's first checkup. You ready? We're gonna hopefully get our first official ultrasound today and maybe hear the baby's heartbeat and see it. So it should be about yay big. 
not this big anymore, but yay big. We've seen it about this big, and now it's gonna be yay big. So yeah, I'm excited. Are you? Really excited. I'm very excited. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> She's nervous, excited, everything. Same with me. Like my 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 heart's like. <laughs> I mean, we actually might hear her heart over the baby's heart because it would just be like. But yeah, we're ready. Look at that smiling face right there. Look at that beautiful face. I don't know, but you look good. <laughs> Alright, let's go. This area right here is your uterus, okay? Uh, so that's the, uh, not the, that's the gestational sac. That's the baby's kind of hanging out in. And then you see that little bubble at the bottom of that black area. That, that's actually your baby. We're going to try to get a good picture where you can see the actual shape. Oh, that's a great picture of the heart rate. See that flicker? Right in the, right in the middle of the baby right there. Look at that. You can actually see heart valves flicking in there. That's awesome. So Amy's fir first like real pregnancy um, appointment was on the 22nd of January. Mm -hmm. That's really exciting. <laughs> yeah, we got to meet the doctor for the first time. Mm -hmm. She's awesome. The one who's gonna be following us through everything, which I'm is very which happy is with her. yeah. She was she's in the Air Force, which is kind of cool. <laughs> the fact that like it's a uniform. Family oriented yeah. too, because all my family's in the Air Force. <laughs> we, we may not have been able to like actually hear the heartbeat. But it was really cool just seeing it. Yeah, pulsate, pulsate, pulsate. and the baby was more developed. Mm -hmm. It wasn't such a little blob like it was when we saw it in the ER. Yeah, the so when we saw it in the first one, it was just like this, like triple blob. Yeah, like, a little thing, like thing. Yeah, and the doctor was just like, yeah, there's, there's, there's a pregnancy, something there. Yeah, <laughs> we're like, oh. <laughs> but since uh, since the baby was laying in, in a weird way. Um, we couldn't really get like a good measurement and like... You could only like get the head or like the bottom of the body or yeah. whatever, so and it wasn't like lining up. We couldn't up. really date it, so we had to go back for another um, ultrasound, mm -hmm. which we went to today. Well, here's Amy. She's getting ready to get an ultrasound. You excited? Yeah, but I'm nervous. This is technically our third one, but this one's going to give us a better picture of what the baby's like. So we're super excited. Yeah. But yeah, we're gonna see gonna get the date and more of a picture of the baby. Yeah. And we're gonna get the date, and then we're gonna get the heart rate. We're gonna probably hear the heart. So we're we're excited. we're excited. You excited? Yeah. Except for it's gonna be one of those vaginal ones, which sucks. <laughs> there it is, right over there. <laughs> I'm not excited over that. <laughs> I wouldn't be either. But onward to the ultrasound. Woo! That's crazy. There's a baby right there moving around. <laughs> There's a baby. That's only a wiggle one. He's, he's awake. Yeah. He or she. A flutter in the middle is the heartbeat. We'll measure that later, okay? That's crazy. Now we're gonna listen, okay? I'm going to pause it now so that we can measure it. 188, which in very early pregnancy is extremely normal. Baby's doing good. Keep adjusting. That might be pretty good right there. We can take that measurement. Easy. <laughs> no, wow. So here is baby Shigru at 11 weeks. So, that was successful. We got Our pictures. Baby. Our baby. Our baby. <laughs> little, little, little hand over little here. Little handsy and then body. body. 11 weeks and one day today. 
So I guess August twenty second. August twenty second is due date. The due date. But um, we'll see. I feel like they're just gonna chill in there for a while. Yeah. But um yeah we found out that every Wednesday is our like week birthday for for baby. So it'll be it's good to know. So yesterday I guess was eleven weeks. So we're not that far behind from nope. what we thought. So nope, we definitely aren't. I was worried. We're worried. We thought it was gonna be nine weeks, but yeah. But yeah, we're we're good to go. Eleven weeks. Yeah. Two more weeks, and she's out of the first trimester. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she might not feel that sick anymore. Hallelujah. Yeah, but uh, good visit today. Awesome stuff. Mm -hmm. And now we're gonna. Everything. Now we gotta go find this one food. Yeah, let's this go. This one's starving. Yeah, that one's starving. Okay. <laughs> let's go. So today was a really amazing day. Mm -hmm. It was a very emotional day too. It like, really was. Today was the first day we got to hear the heartbeat. Mm -hmm. That was uh, that almost got me. Like I almost like lost it. And... What I thought was crazy is like it was like in the very beginning, like the baby like started like squiggling and like you could actually like yeah. literally see it moving like with its head and like its body yeah, like and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and little arms. It, it, it. <laughs> it waved at us like that. The doctor made like the picture like go. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was and then the other doctor was like, no, 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 let's be serious. <laughs> yeah, like I don't know, understand though. That one doctor was like, hey, let's have a good time. You know, hey, okay. baby's so on the way. And then the other one's like, hmm. Mm. Well, I want to be serious. <laughs> I made Whatever. A, yeah, I made a joke and he, he didn't really appreciate it. And then it was funny. Yeah. Nurse liked it. Too. Yeah, she the nurse laughed, so I wish I could. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so here in the heartbeat. Yeah, it was amazing. amazing. And this time we actually got to come home with pictures. <gasps> yeah. Like so. <sighs> pictures. He's got a little hand. Yeah, it's like waving right there. Got the baby baby picture. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Wow. And here are our announcement picture that we made today. Yeah. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> look at that cute picture. I know. Whoa. We posted it on Instagram at the same time. Yep. We went one, two, three, post. But yeah, anyway, so amazing day. Yes. Amazing things happening. Yeah. Um, and that's really all we want to tell you guys. Mm -hmm. That's our story it's so Friday. far, and there's more to come on this. Yeah, hopefully, just keep us in your thoughts and prayers. And mm -hmm. Good pregnancy, and I'm almost done with first tri trimester, so I'm really excited for that because I don't want to be sick anymore. Yeah. But <laughs> and stay tuned for more updates. Yeah, because we're excited to become parents. Yeah, it's gonna be a fun journey. Mm -hmm. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, and all that fun stuff. And we'll see you next Friday, as always. Yeah.